we're out here today shooting this FMK model uh, 9C1. It's the second generation of these guns. been slightly redesigned. Anyway, the, uh, first got to shoot one of these in Florida back, uh, heck, back a few months ago. And uh, they, they sent me one to review here. And it's a, a nice, relatively lightweight 9mm pistol. Uh, one thing really unique about this one, uh, you can't really see the writing in the video here, but it's got, you can see it in the still pictures, um, they're pretty uh, pro Second Amendment, especially for th these guns are made in California, which is something that it's really hard to do. Besides the federal government, the California government makes it extremely hard for somebody to be a gun manufacturer in California. Right here on top says, In God We Trust, United States of America. Over here on the frame says, Thank you, U.S. Soldiers. Uh, and it's got the Bill of Rights inscribed on this slide all the way around it. Anyway, back to the, the function of the gun. It's got a real good feel to the grip. The trigger reach is easy. It's a lot to, a lot easier to reach around than say, you know, some of the comparable uh, bulkier square frame uh, guns on the market. It's of course got a polymer frame. It's got a, a safety in the trigger. It's got a, a firing pin safety where if you drop it, it can't go off. It also has a mag safety. Uh, this, this particular one, there's a 14 round mag and there's a 10 round mag for if you live in some of the communist areas of the country. But anyway, it's got a uh, loaded chamber indicator. Real nice weapon. Shoots good, easy to shoot. It's been 100% reliable so far. It's got an accessory rail on it right here. Um, anyway, it's got a, a nice heavy extractor. Just uh, ex giving no reliability problems. It also comes with a left handed magazine release. Um, I, I'm a left handed. I've always used a magazine release. Hit it with my trigger finger, but a lot of people prefer to do the thumb like a right-hander. It comes with one you can swap out for that if you want to. Also, for adjusting the sights on this, it's got some nice three-dot sights on it, and it comes with extra sights instead of um, so that you can change the windage on it without having to drift it or whatever. You've got the different sights that you change in and out. You've got two extra front sights for elevation adjustment and different rear sights for different uh, windage adjustments on it. The notch is offset on it. So you can just change the sights out and uh, adjust the sights on your pistol. That way you got nothing that's going to get knocked over and drifted accidentally or whatever. Once you get it set, it's going to stay there. Uh, anyway, it's a good gun. Shoots good. Real reliable. 9mm. Relatively lightweight. Easy to carry. Easy to conceal well. Uh, relatively smooth. There's no projects on here to cut into your side or into your clothing or whatever. And it's from uh, FMK Firearms. It's a 100% made in the USA, very reasonably priced, and we're just going to shoot a little bit and play with it today. We got this uh, FMK stoked up with a mag full of uh, Fioca canned heat. We're going to demonstrate shooting here on a human silhouette at 10 yards. Uh, uh, it's uh, real good, made for social work. It's good to carry, and for purposes like this, it's easy to shoot. You pull it out, there's no safeties to flip or anything. You just, just point and start shooting. It also has double strike capability, which that's important to a lot of people if. Uh, if you got a primer that don't go off on the first trigger pull or whatever, you can pull this one again and it'll go. Uh, most uh, polymer frame uh, 9mm weapons on the market won't do that. This FMK will do that if you need to. It's not real important with a good modern ammo. If you buy good stuff, you just don't have that problem. But it's good to know that it'll do it if you need to. You know, we're just going to shoot a little bit, demonstrate the recoil. It's real easy to control and uh, real easy to keep on target. 